Griffin uh, Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. This Bigfoot has always been part of my family. And just so everybody knows, it will be in the museum, the Bigfoot Museum of North America. Good evening, folks. Alien Addict here. Last Christmas, nah, not it's not a George Michael thing, this, um, but last Christmas, I saw a video of a guy that had Bigfoot's frozen head that his dad killed in the 1950s. The channel name is Peter Kane Dog Trainer. And... It is now my probably. It's not a featured channel on Alien Addict, but it's. I, I'm I'm dying to put it out there. I love this guy. He's a fucking genius. He's yes, he's a dog training channel. Um, he's he's a very funny chap. He does some great vlogs, but he also presents Bigfoot body parts that his dad killed Bigfoot in the 1950s. You can see it has a lot of ice ice on it. It, it has remained frozen. You can see its, its eyeball there. This is very heavy. It weighs about 120 pounds. So I can't move it by myself. I have to have somebody help me move it. There's a lot of debris still frozen in it. I have somebody here to help me move it so that we can see the other side. It's plain to see that it is some sort of paper mache. He's, he's done a good job as the lad is here. He's put a beard on it. He's, he's put some eyes in it and hair and bits of skull and brain and a bit of backbone popping out neck bone whatever but the guy has actually stuck real bits of meat to the paper mache that's i have respect for practical effects if you're going to be a hoaxer and you do a practical effect you have my respect there's a lot of fucked up people in the bigfoot community there are i'm sick of it I'm going to take the foot and I'm going to use a hairdryer and I'm going to thaw out this back area where you could see the second bone. You know, hoaxing things in CGI to me is just a lazy man. But when you craft it with your own hands, yeah, I, I, I'm cool with that. You know, it, 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 it's interesting. I like to look what people have created. This guy's made, um, well, he's, he's made his foot first and then a head uh, a penis yeah he, he made bigfoot's penis now if that's not dedication to hoaxing then i don't know what is I, I believe he's even done an alien out of paper mache you know and said its skin looks weird it's like paper yeah but i hope i really hope peter sees this and doesn't take this as the wrong way to, to this video just kind of like putting him down or what have you because I just think the whole the guy himself if I'm going to leave his make sure you head over to his channel please subscribe to this guy watch some of his vlogs he's hilarious his actual personality is brilliant um <clears throat> he's a hoaxer but he's like he's a hoax that I love I, I, I do a bit like third phase of moon I like them guys and Rick the prick I, I like him you know if you've got personality and you're a bit funny and a quirky, hoax, hoax away. Why not? But he did this video. Let me let me just play a little bit of this video for you. It's it's the hand that got me, and it's the passion he put behind it. I mean, look, there, there's there's insects that are going towards it because it's it's thawing out. And you know it's it's that's what they like. That's that's what bees and flies like is shit like this. It's it's dead flesh. It's you know it's it's completely real. Look at it. It's in the light. You can see. Somebody said that there's no marrow. There is marrow in there. I'm sorry. There's marrow in there. This is this is completely real. There. That's that's marrow. Okay. This is meat. This is not. 
plastic, it's not wax, it's meat. It's real. I'm president to the Bigfoot community. I would never lie to you. I would never lie to you, believe me. It's completely real. For those wasps, look, you can, you can see one of the wasps is, is, is still on it. Look. Right? How is that possible? That, to me, that's genius what he did. You know, he's got a bit of paper mache, he's put some hair on it, he's put some nails in it, a bit of dog bone, a bit of bit of steak, some honey, and uh, beef jerky. Um, and he's fooled you with it. And I just got respect for that. The guy's an artist. You know, you can't... I, I thought to myself when I first saw that head, I thought, this guy's really like, kind of like, just trying to fool the world with this. And it's not, I'm not buying it, but I see what you're doing, Peter. I see. I see you just want to put yourself out there and to say, you know, this is what I make, this is what I can do, and I can fool you with this shit. Um, and I have respect for that. Yeah. Well done. Now, let's talk about the penis. Notice the length, the girth of the penis. See the head? The urethra? See the urethra there? Now, uh oh, it's affecting my electricity. Peter Kane, the dog trainer, did make Bigfoot's penis. Um, and here's what he did with it. Yeah, I think it's coming. Oh yeah, I think it's coming. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, now we're talking. Now we got some jizz draining. Oh, yeah, baby, go. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that flowing. Yeah, we got we got pure, pure Sasquatch jizz coming out. Look at that. It's fucking amazing. Come on, every, every last drop. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Let's milk it like a cow. Come on. He relieved it, you know. I, I, what more respect can I have for a man that wanks off Bigfoot's penis? <laughs> On a YouTube video, yeah. Um, also, he he, um, he was molested um, by. He states a female. Bigfoot, not a male Bigfoot. I've been molested, you know. Nobody wants to help me. I've been molested by a Sasquatch, and I know a lot of people are saying that it wasn't a female Sasquatch, that it was a male Sasquatch, and it wasn't. It was a female. I'm not gay. I'm not. Well, we know you're not gay, Pia. Um, not that that matters, you know. You, it's Bigfoot's penis. It's not a man's penis. It's just a Bigfoot penis. Oh yeah, that's that's pure Sasquatch jizz. So there you have it, Peter Kane, dog trainer. Make sure you go over and check that channel. It's really it's it's a fun channel um i think a lot of hoaxes need to take a leaf out of peter's book and be a little bit more creative in their hoax and not give us this cgi shite you know i think i changed my ways um because i i really enjoyed watching peter's content it and i will leave in the description his other channel which is uh i don't know the name of it. it's a really long-winded name but it's something to do with bigfoot um where he just does his bigfoot stuff on there uh, give him some love and tell him I'll send you over. Maybe he might pay me some attention um, and give me a copyright strike or something like that. That'd be nice. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I'm Alien Addict. Like, sub share, sub share, subscribe, and uh, mind the bugs don't bite. That's fucking bone. This is the, the notion that I could.
make something like this out of wax, I would have to be a fucking genius. I'd have to be a fucking genius to be able to produce these. It's absurd. It's absurd. Who, who could make something like this? God made these, okay?